Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I decided to film an everyday summer makeup tutorial. Um, this is basically what I do on a regular basis during the summer. It's still basically an all out everyday look because I do put on everything. But it's pretty simple and easy and it works well for me. So if you want to see how it is that I achieve this look, then please keep watching. So as you can see, I've already put on my foundation and eyebrows. Now I'm just taking my Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and underneath of my eyes in a triangular motion, I'm applying this concealer. Anywhere that I apply this concealer will just be adding depth and brightness to my face. So now I like to take a damp beauty blender and just press this concealer into my face. I find that by using pressing motions, this really just sets the product in where I want it and doesn't smear it around. Now using this MAC Studio Fix powder, I'm going to set everywhere that I put my concealer to keep it nice and bright throughout the day. Now using the Master Fix Maybelline Translucent Powder and a Kabuki brush, I'm just going to set all of my foundation. Next taking a Hoola bronzer, I'm just going to be using this soft fluffy brush and kind of buffing that bronzer where my cheekbones are. I don't want anything too precise, so I'm going to take that underneath of my jawline as well as on my forehead, keeping it really soft and bronzy. Now I'm taking a flat top eyeshadow brush to contour my nose. This is not a required step, so just do what you do. And blending that out, of course. Next I'm just taking this Peach Blush by Cargo Cosmetics and buffing it into my cheeks. Now I'm taking my favorite highlight, Mary Luminizer by The Balm, and I'm just taking this tiny fan brush I got with an Urban Decay highlight, and I'm highlighting my face, my nose, my cupid's bow, and of course my chin. Now to take a dance break, of course, um, taking advantage of my pigtails. Moving on, we're just going to set and prime our eyelids using Urban Decay as well as the MAC powder. For my crease, I'm going to be taking the shades Burlap and Saddle. First using Burlap to blend into my crease using a fluffy Sigma E40 brush. Sorry, I totally forgot the name for a second even though I use it every day. Just keep blending, just keep blending. What do we like to do? It's blend, 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 blend. Would you look at that blending from a different angle? Now taking the shade Saddle and a smaller blending brush, I'm going to be in a much smaller radius, blending this out toward my eyebrow and about halfway into my crease. Don't forget to blend. Next, taking this shade saddle and a pencil brush, I'm going to squint my eyes as I'm doing here. And I'm just going to use the tip of that pencil brush and I'm going to fill in where the crease is when I squint. This is going to create kind of bags underneath of my eyes and I know that sounds crazy and silly and it may look weird and it for sure doesn't work for everyone but I find that it looks really flattering on my eyes. I got the initial idea from Samantha but I kind of made it my own and I started doing it slightly different but essentially I just will go back and continue to shadow in that little crease. Next using burlap and a fluffy brush I'm just going to fill in that area underneath my eye. Now taking the shade Melon on my finger, I'm just going to pat that on my eyelid. Using the shade Moonlight on a round brush, I'm just going to be pressing that into my inner corner. 
Now using the mascara of your liking, apply it to your top and bottom lashes as usual. Next, taking this nude eye pencil by Cargo Cosmetics, I'm filling in my waterline. Now we're taking a dance break because we've made it to the lashes. So now we're going to apply my all-time favorite lashes. They're in the style Samantha by Blinking Butte, and I'm waiting for them to dry so they don't fall off my face. Now using MAC Fix Plus, I'm just going to spray my face down. Now I'm going to be taking these lip products by NYX Cosmetics. I'm taking this lip liner in the shade Nutmeg, which is a really beautiful brown shade. And I'm just going to slightly overdraw my lips. Now taking this NYX Lip Lingerie in the shade Lace Detail, I'm just going to be applying this to my lips and then I'm going to pat it in with my finger to make sure it is smooth and even. And of course I'm going to finish this off with NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Tiramisu. Voila, we made it to the end, congrats. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something cool and new today. If you did, then give me a thumbs up and like it. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at beauty at heart and check out my website, www.beautyatheart.com. And I will see you next time. Also, if you have any suggestions for future videos, leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching.